morning. Boteco is a no frills neighborhood meeting place and it's hosting its monthly wine tasting. Michelle can't get over how big these wine bottles are. I love are. them. <laughs> okay, and we're going to do a little test. Look at that. Wow. Yeah. Of our knowledge of wines and okay. also you're going to learn, okay, what wines pair best with what types of foods and how you can get in on this monthly wine tasting. So we have Bottego owner, Marcus Fortunato, and also Bottego wine host, Brian Maxey. Thank you guys for being with Thanks us. Thanks for having us. Appreciate it. Welcome back, I should say, because you've been here before. Okay, so where do we want to start on this journey? Are we going to start down on this side? Sure. Okay. Just, just first, I'd like to just talk a little bit about Wine Wednesdays. We hold it every other a month on the last Wednesday of the month okay, very and good. basically we kind of avoid the technicality of wine we kind of hate wine snobs <laughs> we actually welcome people that it. never had wine before That's fantastic. and we're gonna talk about popes hills uh, churches we're gonna talk about monks wow. and less about the technical aspects of wine and take people on a journey throughout regions of the world mm. and let them explore I love not that. us tell them what they should drink yeah and when it comes to pairing uh, there's a big myth on how to pair in the 70s. Okay. We used to be told you drink white before with, red. Yeah. And that evolved to white with fish, yes. red with meat. That's what I've always heard. And that's kind of a cop out in our book. Oh. So what we did today is I have some soft shell chili crab, which has got a little spice mm -hmm. in it, uh, a little sriracha, mm. uh, a glazed cast iron salmon oh, with favorite. almond rice, yes. which has got a little sweetness to it. Okay. And then for a twist, just to trick you, I brought some buttered popcorn oh, okay. that does pair with wine. Oh. So we have a beautiful Gurgage Hills, a family that we're very close to. Uh -huh. We have a bocelli oh. made by the brother of Andrea Bocelli. Oh, yeah. That's what I was in thinking. Yeah. Veneto. And we have a beautiful Pinot Noir, actually Ooh. from the origin of the cellar in Burgundy. Wow. So we have a Pinot Noir, uh, Pinot, Pinot Grigio, Grigio, and a Chardonnay. And I'd like you to, in your mind, what, what goes with what? Oh, my gosh. You know I know <laughs> nothing about it. You would know more than that, I would. Okay. So I would say um, I would drink any of them with anything. But if I had to choose, maybe the, maybe the Pinot Grigio with the popcorn? Okay. Uh, the red with the fish. Okay. And the Chardonnay with the hot sauce. Your with first the crab. answer. Your first answer was correct. You really? can drink anything oh. with oh, okay. anything. Uh, <laughs> Me personally. Actually, from a technical point of view, all you would do is this. Just what you want. Oh, okay. That, Not that's bad. It. And why? Not bad. Uh, because Pinot Grigio has a little more sweetness Sweet. to it, and ah, it needs it to balance off spicy. with the peppers, Good where point. Chardonnay has a little more, more butter to it, it and it oh, combines uh, with the butter popcorn perfectly. Very but I got the red one. The red one is perfect. Yeah. Yeah. But when it comes to wine pairing, I see it like online dating. All right, you can build a profile. There's a famous word that says what grows together goes together. Okay. Yeah. But when it comes to wine, actually your palate and the company across from the table is more important than what's in the bottle. Wow. If the company is boring, raise the alcohol level <laughs> uh, and explore it yourself. I so love it. forget online dating, don't go by a pr profile, don't pair wine with yeah. food compliment food with wine. You know what, Marcus? I love this journey you just took us on. So tell people where your cross streets are so they can get involved in all this fun that you have going on. Uh, we're located at 9500 Eastern Avenue, uh, south of Pebble. Excellent. Hey, check them out. Fun Times Botego. I enjoyed our little lesson that here, was didn't fun. you? That was fun. That was. All right, stay with us. We'll be right back.